I recently attended the annual Australian Shareholders Association Conference. I managed to catch up with Richard Goida from West Farmers. Here's what he had to say about the business. Put it at the foot of every decision we make. So we say, is this going to be good for our shareholders? And as I said in the presentation, we're unashamedly financially focused. So, so every decision we make, we put a financial um, framework around generally and we look at, do we think this will create value? We have our own internal systems of calculating that. Uh, it's very disciplined, uh, as I said, patient. And, and all of us are shareholders, so we want to make sure we're making the right decision for shareholders as well. Well, they're serious players. You know, Aldi is a very, very large German business. Costco is a very, very large US-owned business. Little if it ever comes is a significant business. Uh, Woolworths obviously is larger than Coles and Metcash through and the IGA stores, big players. And then there's all the other independent businesses. So it is, it's a competitive sector. Uh, and, and Aldi and Costco certainly have brought new competition into the market. And we have to be really, really good to be better than them and to make sure customers are coming to us. So that, that means we've got to be strong on value, we're strong on our fresh offer, strong on the service we've got and have great relationships with our suppliers so we can get uh, food and products into our stores efficiently uh, for, the, for the good of our customers. It's a remarkable story Bunnings and it has been really since I joined West Farmers. You know, it's been a business I've looked at with some degree of, uh, I don't like the word, but envy. You know, when I ran one of the other businesses, I thought, gee, what a great business this is, and it has been for many years. Why? Uh, good people, really good management, uh, an absolute focus on the customer, a great value, and, and they live their, um, their strategy. You know, lowest prices every day, great service, great range. And it's simple, but it, there's a lot of hard work that's gone into it and a lot of innovation some really good people at Bunnings creating new things all the time. Well, we're always looking at things. Uh, some are too small, some are in areas that we'd prefer not to operate in. Some we think just financially are too hard. So that's, there's the, that sorting process. Then if financial data looks okay, then we start getting serious and saying, well, what can we do? What management can we apply? How would we? How would the government structure look like? You know, can we really make this work for shareholders? And that they're the sort of that's when we get serious. I think business confidence actually is a bit better than people think it is at the moment, and certainly consumer confidence is. I, I think it, it more if there's concern, it more relates to people feeling that government needs to do more to get the fiscal position of the country sorted and more to put in place policies that support the business sector. Uh, and obviously there's some parts of the economy that are doing it tough, but you know, this country, you know, we should be really grateful. We've, we're still growing. We've had 20 something years of economic growth. We're positioned on the doorstep of the growth economies of the world. We've got really well-educated people. And notwithstanding the comments I made earlier, you know, government that's fiscal position generally is in reasonable shape. So we've got, I think, a lot to be confident about and at the end of the day it's business that actually is going to drive things and, and, and we should accept that and take up the challenge. Because it's such a great job, Christine, it's so much fun. Uh, and it's, you know, it's not always fun, it's challenging, and, but, but running a company like West Farmers with our diverse set of businesses with the terrific people we've got and shareholders and all our stakeholders. Uh, I get out of bed every day really looking forward to going to work and, and trying to do my bit with 200,000 others to see if we can make a difference. Mm -hmm.